three to recognize in public in my life only once or twice one time at the gym like three or four years ago and then one time i was on a flight to twitch gone that's basically it dude we're at the escape room and the guy's like if you guys gave me the same answer like he's gonna ask us a question and we get like we get like a percentage deal off or some shit right and the like he was like what is your biggest peeve like respond for the other person and i answered i answered i think it's a green or it's red no, fuck you. it's uh whatever um i responded leaving the toilet seat up because she hates when i leave it up she's like that's bacteria or whatever right and she responds three losing lanes well, after we have to get the same answer she says fucking through like to a fucking random guy is at an escape room what the fuck i hope he doesn't know who the fuck we are after that i could not believe my eyes i kind of want to work the raptors I better wear like 116, but it's kind of scarier. Play Stormgate when League dies. I heard that game. I don't know what that is, though. I'll try to show it tonight. I need a single player game. League MMO, Stormgate, where the fuck that is. Just Dark and Dark. At least Dark and Dark is three players max. This fucking League shit. Why is there four people on my team? I can't 1v9 anymore. My role is fucking trash. My top's already dead. The game just fucking started. Wave zero. He's dead. Oh, thank God. My enemy top is as bad as ours. She's not wrong, but like, she always complains about that, so I'm sure she's gonna have the same answer as me. But I guess I was wrong. I didn't just three camp top before my shitty top laner dies. He's actually going top lane fast as well. He's three camping top. I mean, I kind of want to full clear on Kha'Zix, but uh, my top laner is getting fucking destroyed. He's about to ward as well. I could eat over the wall, but I don't know if we can actually kill him. Just play Overwatch. Controlling? Or my first fucking game. In like four hours, I can't believe it. I trolled, but like, I don't even crash it fast enough. I'm just gonna jump in case. Never mind. Yeah, I only flash for like someone playing Kha'Zix, and like, doesn't really matter. The first five minutes of the game, I'm having flash. I'm just farming anyways. I mean, I could have smited, but I think this guy's gonna... Okay, drop XP and gold mid. I don't know why you got that, but okay. Actually, we're in a bad spot now. I might as well just fucking gank, you know? I'm at red buff too. How did my colleague not kill him? I know he missed E, but like what? I'm so ahead of the jungler, but like... I guess I should die for the... I don't know how he didn't. I don't really smite eyes with the camp, but I have two smites anyway, so... It's fine here. My bot's seem pretty good, at least. LL Stylish? That's LL Stylish? I mean, I didn't think it was that retarded, I'm gonna be honest. He lost? He should have died mid for going for that grab, because his wave didn't crash. And he got he lost like X spin gold too, so it's such, such a shit play. But I don't know why I did that. But our work is my Akali somehow can't I mean I think my mid plays Z only is what is the problem here. I'm pretty sure Zethel is a one trick Z. But he's not. The fly as far as he only plays Z from I've seen. That's the longest I can wait because I can't really go in earlier. But uh, somehow I'll call you no ult for this fight or use it on Zed or some something else. I don't know. My top has 10 CS at 7 minutes. That's pretty good. Why? Because he's he just face checked Olaf. Level 1 for nothing. That is probably why. The good news is the enemy jungler is doing nothing winning, so like, maybe I have a chance to win. Oh, wait, they can do nothing every game and win anyway, so. I completely forgot about that. I just get my sticks and play for my top side camps with Rift. I lined up my pathing pretty well this game, so that's like all I know how to do on Kha'Zix. I can never get free early game kills, so I'm only spying this hit my red buff faster as well. His red is up, I don't really care about his red, because my red's also up, and it's season 13, so like your, their camp takes 6 hours to clear. I'm gonna play for the Rift Herald. When I pick up red buff, if the red buff means I'm playing for bot. The bot lane's fine, if you see their jungler top, who cares. Or if this worth infinite.
And I should have killed her. I flush him in six. I gotta be preemptively the way for this year. It's probably better to W him, but I feel like doesn't do shit, honestly. Can I do this? It's kind of risky. Is that just exoding my shitty mid laner? Alright, I cheese this riff for free, that's pretty good. I got both neutrals. I really have their jungler too, and I bot lane's winning, so this game is probably much, pretty much guaranteed to win. There's an honor level diff. It's an honor level diff. Brother, my Kha'Zix build is a... Uh, Dirk into Ravenous every game. I haven't played Khan so long though. I could buy my Eclipse, but like, it's okay. How's this champ so bad it's beyond me? Kha'Zix? I mean, if you can free farm, he's good. But like, farming sucks in this meta, so the next patch will be probably better. That's so why I'm gonna try to play him a bit more now. He's always one of my highest win rate champions in Chali. I mean, honestly, him dying one for one is always winning. So our bot one's winning, I just tower dive bot whenever some gold. So my champ sucks at tower diving. I mean, I have infinite gold next to here. And the towers are going HP too. I'm gonna just wait for the dinghy. Oh, it bugged. Might as well cleanse. Whatever. Of course, there are problem bugs like this. I'm gonna assist. Or whatever. <laughs> whatever, I don't even care. Wow. If my rift didn't bug there, I don't actually die. But I took an extra 500 tower damage shot. Like 470 or some shit. That rift bug is like actually pretty like rare. I say it's like a one rift out of like 20 you see that shit. It's so rare, but it happens. I don't know why always to me. I'm the victim. What the fuck? This guy disconnect? It's a good cause this game though. Like, the jungler's so behind. And my poke is so fucking good against their team. They're full melee. I don't think spawn is that bad, he was pretty much solo in my games. I always thought it was underrated, but I don't know. <clears throat> That's about ignoring Biofrost, not his release fault to be honest. I mean, honestly, Biofrost kind of improved, but like, <laughs> not for pro standards, that's for sure. How am I winning HP for my fucking blue buff? What is this? Still have my item too. And GP trading kills always winning for us, because he outskills Olaf so hard. Our comp shits on this with our poke. Is that dying? Get an extra longsword off that. Much needed longsword. This game. Isn't Ravnus Hydra way worse for champs like Kallax since no Omni Vamp anymore? It's mostly for clearing your camps, but I know what you mean. But you do auto. But yeah, I agree. Not as much. You have to remember your Isolate autos do a lot more damage too, so you have to auto on your combo sometimes, but it's mostly for the clear. I mean, I could just sit on Tiamat too, right, but I don't know. I feel like the item is still fine. The clear is just like so much faster though, because they're just not going to be isolated. The small ones die. I don't fucking pink forward. I don't know if you saw me. Oh, you didn't see me. One more level to actually be slow. He actually got a stun off with one HP. Honestly, I think it's just Black Cleaver into Eclipse. I think that's the Kha'Zix build. With like, maybe First Strike, I don't know. Cause this... I felt like, kinda sad. That I couldn't even kill the Isolated Annie. With an auto Q. So yeah, maybe this is trash. Maybe you are right. This time's what, 3.3k? 2.4k? I lose a thousand gold if I sell it. I honestly, might just sell it this game. But look how fast I clear. It's actually like good. Only for that reason, though. Yeah, if I had any other item except this shitty one, Annie was dead. So 
he made it me. I want to go for the like walking towards this. Yeah, we just need to play block. We want like res res respect the mid. That'd be pretty good. I think I need more treads. Call my build is so garbage this game. It was cleaver. But we're also like very heavy AP, so cleaver's not that good. So I think it's like eclipse. I don't even actually I don't even know what to build this game, I'll be honest. No walk can't play the game to Kha'Zix. Unfortunately for him. Yeah. 40 stocks, so holy shit, I'm supposed to- I only died once with this item. Oh fuck, he's actually there. I guess Malachi was on Crab. My fault for jumping like that for damage. Okay, but like, ask ask yourself this question: How can a zero item any do seven hundred damage to me? Level six, level six ults. That is fucking sad. I mean, she is one of the highest weight champs in the game, but still, like, she has no items and she did more damage than her entire team. Ignited two ticks, three ticks. Like, look how fast that clear. Like, it just feels like shit not having this item. A 70 CS and he's down three levels. He should be down like five. But okay. I don't think I have time for rift. Do I go chem punk this game? He does have Ravnus Hydra. I think I do need exact item. Cleaver's kinda bad this game. I think we should go chem punk. My cam is on. What the fuck are you talking about? You can't see me? He has no flush. I think he's gonna move you on. I actually have a level on him. Wow, I actually ran. I read buff. Poke doesn't matter. No way. Yeah, I mean they can't win this game either way, but I guess I die again. I guess we all have four deaths on our team. I thought I died a lot this game, but not really. This Annie has no tier 2 boots still. Why do we need anti heal? Are you trolling? Or I can't tell. If you're not trolling, basically I have an Olaf. Uh, I can tell you all of his abilities and things that heal him. His passive, his conqueror, his death dance, and his triumph. Okay, next one. Maokai. I mean, sure, Maokai's not that much healing, but he does have his uh, passive. Sure, minimal healing. Zed, conqueror, prob I mean, he has probably his presence of mind, right? He has this. And yeah, that's basically it. And then you have Samira. Who, um, do I have to explain Samira's healing to you, or I don't know either. The only chance I have healing on my team is Annie. Yeah, is that good enough like, explanation for you? Fang isn't bad. Oh yeah, that's my next item. I need Ken Punk first. I'm Piyosha, guys. I'm getting blue buff real quick. Or buff seven. I mean, we just have infinite poke. They can't do shit. Oh, they just all have fucking flash? They play so scared on the team. I'll just do this for 15, I guess. Tarzan's so chill today. Hm. I think someone missed the few, first few games of the stream. How did not FF yet? Your jungle has one item at 30 minutes. FF, please, man. I need a win. I'm really desperate. But yeah, I am going Serpents this game. It's either that or Edge of Night. And honestly... I think Edge Knight's better, to be honest, because of Annie. Lurch guys aren't really enough. Look at this wave clear, it feels so fucking good. Or jungle clear camps, speed, dingy. Oh my god, we have- I just realized we have Red Dragon with fucking Poke Comp. They can't win. I should have splash not you good my damage there. Okay, spawn goes off here. My god, you guys said this guy's the worst ADC in LCS? 
I don't know, but he hit every Q, so that's all I'm gonna say. He kind of hit every Q there. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like my Akali has been AFK the entire game. Enemy Zed's at every fight, Akali isn't. And they still lost. What's up, Quantum? You still shit talking in the stream, buddy? I mean, I don't I don't mind you like shit talking in the stream, right? Like, I really don't give a fuck. You can like showcase me as like a crazy person that flame rejects, but like, when someone like Pie Cake Lurk and die level 2 to Sun, I mean, I'm just gonna fucking type the entire game. And if you want to, like, cry about that, I really don't give a fuck, so. I like you, Quantum, but, like, the way you showcase me in your stream, I don't know if it's, like, a bandwagon thing or, like, a, oh, everyone hits Tarzan, so I hit him too, or whatever. It's just kind of cringe. And you can deny it, but, like, I've watched your stream. And, uh, yeah, it's fine if you don't want to talk good about me in your stream. You, sh you shouldn't have to, like, fake like me, right? I really don't care. But just don't, like, at least have the decency to admit when I'm shit-talking someone... Like Pie Kick Lord, who dies level 2 to Sion as Gangplank. There's a reason, right? Why he gets flamed for 30 minutes straight.